Right, we're ready for kick-off here at Curzon Action versus Hereford, uh, so over to you Matt. Thank you very much, referee checking with his goalkeepers and blows the first whistle of the evening. We're underway here at Tameside, Hereford shooting left to right in the first half which uh, ushers all of those fans as I described before, kick-off on the left to the right. Ball's out for a throw-in on the far side. Oh, and those goal-scoring positions. Mars Story still trying to find the back of the net again. Kuyar with the corner, right-footed high over towards the back post. Egan heads back across goal. He's going to drop well over the bar and out for a goal kick. And on the right-hand side, Stroud comes in from Adam Thomas. It was almost a, a cross turned into a shot. Sondergaard had to cover his far post. Vincent's feet but in a dangerous position as he's crowded out by two or three players and now Curzon Ashton with a break down the centre it's come over to Curran with a strike on the right hand side block back out to Curran again trying to get past three men in white Curran trying to work his way through told to get up by the referee as he goes down Sondergaard still being pressured though by Piers chases it down the left hand side now Reven well, will he get on to the end of this one it will just about slow down into the corner Reven first time cross into the box left back by <laughs> Miles Storey who just dragged it back across goal he might even have been able to take a shot and Josh Gowling is urging him now to think about taking the shot next time Miles Storey being unselfish and now Curzon Ashton down the other end crossing from the right hand side free header straight into the hands of Sondergaard as Piers jumped up ahead of everyone Plays it back to Patton now, eyes on goal, but it's back to Kuyar taking the ball down the left-hand side, evades one challenge, tries to go into the area, does so, gets the shot away, blocks it out for another corner on the far side. Kuyar doing what he did against Chester and just keeps on running forward. Hodgkiss goes to Tom Owen Evans. Hodgkiss crossing towards the box as he got the ball back. Kuyar goes up for a high header, but uh, couldn't control it. Renshaw keeps hold and comes to the edge of his area. Down the right-hand channel. Lussie's making the run with it. Richard's still going here down the right-hand side, trying to get past Reven. Slides in, misses the challenge. Headed in by Piers into the hands of Sondergaard. Inside by Renshaw. Well headed back in by Thomas. Oh, three down the right. Set three down the right-hand side. Curran's waiting in the area for the ball to come across. Waiting at the far post. Finally, ball, ball goes in. Headed over again by Thomas Piers. Reven committed himself then almost on the halfway line Kuyar on the near side might go short goes for the outswinging corner towards the far post goes up towards Egan heads into the air Pollock goes up against Renshaw and now Renshaw will try and clear away quickly waits for all of his players the chances Renshaw clears away over the halfway line well headed by Egan forward as Mars Story will chase on here Mars Story again one on one might be dragged down gets the shot away into the side netting Miles Story chased away down the left hand side was being dragged back at every attempt oh, gets a good touch away from Richards now leaves Reven free down the left hand side Reven might have a one on one opportunity Vopil tries to open up a shot on his left slipped at the vital attempt to try and square a ball through McLean's now chasing on the far side as Challenger's going to beat him to it up on the edge of the area right footed cross blocked away though by McLean at the first instance Barton now has an opportunity takes a shot in towards the area it's going to drop and it's into the net Thomas Piers slots through and it's an opening goal for the home side only four minutes in to the second half McLean plays it to Tom Owen Evans down the centre instead turns away from his man and Lussie can't get some control over the ball out to Kuya on the left hand side takes it in to the penalty area towards the byline plays it back Tom Owen Evans leaves this one for Reven Reven now chasing gets the shot away and he's dragged it well wide and out for a goal kick tries to run away from Lussie down the centre plays it short to Vincent Hodgkiss on the overlap on the right hand side it's gone far past him first time cross into the area Kuyar's waiting at the near it's going to drop out Tom Owen Evans gets around the referee gets the strike away Vincent tries to play it down to Kuyar again on the right hand side of the area in line with the six yard line goes to the bite and wins the corner almost a right back position the flowers goes through story and now again it's uh, Tom Pierce trying to make his way through and he's given the top opportunity to shoot. It's hit someone's back windscreen, bounced off a roof of the car inside. Good turn from on as he cuts into the middle. Gets the shot away on his left foot. Oh, what a goal! What a fantastic strike from the Curzon Ashton captain. Craig Mahon with a wonder strike on the edge of the area. 
who tries to bring the ball forward. Switches over to Reven on the left-hand side. Good touch, Kuyar is chasing through. Reven, bit more time to take a shot this time. Blocked high into the air from Flowers. It's going to bounce away for a corner. corner. Pinchard looks as though he's going to be lining up to take it. Kuyar, though, is going to leave it for Pinchard. Right-footed in towards the area. Torre gets the head on over the bar, out for a goal kick. Nudged off it, but Toure now still going. He's up against three defenders. Reven's with him through the middle. Toure now plays it over towards Hodgkiss on the right-hand side. Might get the cross in, drills it low, and it could have gone anywhere, but it was cleared away by Connor Teal. Craig Hobson comes back to defend now. Luke Haynes will go for the long throw in. In towards the area. It's a great throw up towards Storey. Knocks down, and Egan gets the shot on his right foot and clears it away and out for it. A goal kick. Hyde Egan plays it to Reven, trying to turn away from his man, and now it's breaking away by Thomas, who tries to play through. Jamie Cook, who's got a one on one opportunity with Sundergaard, comes out, Sundergaard, Cook finds the net, and that's the game for the home side. No doubt in it now, in the 94th minute, it's the substitute, Jamie Cook, who finds the back of the net, and uh, it's going to end 3 0.